The day has finally come, guys. Pokemon have blessed us with more Pokemon tins. It's been literally, I think, about four months since we last opened one. But I'm so pumped up because today we are unboxing none other than the Solgaleo GX Blue Tin. Oh. Seriously, Pokemon need to pull their socks up. It's been absolutely ages since we last unboxed the tin, and I've been craving a tin opening. I've been craving an English boost back opening, and we've got both of them today. And on the front of the tin, are you looking at the artwork of this promo card? Absolutely out of this world. The promo art on the tin as well, it looks so cool. I don't know, I always love the designs. Smoky blew up the top, tribal patterns down the side. Oh, -ho -ho! I don't know what that noise was, but that's how I feel right now. On the sides though, we've got the Sol Galio and we've got Lunala. Um, they've only got two tins out at the moment in collection. Usually it's three, but for t like, I don't know, because the mascots are only two. No real need for a third one, I guess. Then we've got the barcode, the two different mascots again. Legendary Power with Pokemon GX. Yeah, 6 plus. Everything you'd sort of think would be on tin, it's on there. So without further ado, I said we just crack into it. I'm really pumped up and have your fingers crossed that we can return to English TCG and get fantastic pulls. Let's do it. Fellas, the smoke detector's going off. I don't know what, something's on fire. Something is extremely hot and too lit for this video. Oh wait, hang on, don't worry, Just it's just the promo card, it's literally that hot, it's on fire. The artwork is that cool, it's lit. I don't know, one day I'm going to stop making bad jokes and it's going to be a great day for everyone, but uh, <laughs> for now you can put up with them. Check this out, bro, it's a flipping cosmic universe explosion happening on one card, the Soul Galio GX promo card, and it is just insane. 200 and, th like that is insane, and then the whole artwork of the card is just like absolutely mint, the silver around it. The artwork, the rocks explosion, the universe. I, I, oh god, I don't even know what to say. What do you think? Leave a comment in the comment section below. Are you just as taken aback as me? But like, holy mother duck, that's insane. Like, to be honest, I'm sitting here thinking, how can Lunala be any better than this GX card? It's the coolest thing in the world. I'll put this one in the back. We can have a look at it again later on. But for now, we're going to crack into these final four boosters. You get four boosts for that. What the heck? A breakthrough? Come on. What are you doing? We're getting evolutions. That's good. Two Sun and Moons, that's good as well. But what is a breakthrough doing in here? Pokemon, you've got to stop giving me these prehistoric boost packs. I don't know, let's start with the old one. We'll go from there. Have your fingers crossed. I haven't opened up a tin. Oh, maybe... I don't think I've opened up a tin in the brand new setup yet. So have your fingers crossed. Arceus is up there and he can bless us with the goods. I don't think there's anything I really need from breakthrough. I mean, they still got the break cards in there. I... Oh. Look at this artwork, it's flipping, that's, oh gosh, the most depressing thing of 2016. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think this one's just for the lols, we've got a ruffler, a heavy boots, reverse, and then none other. Oh! What? No way! Dude, the new flipping setup is ace! Bro, are you kidding me right now? Of the very first boost pack, of this Solgaleo GX, which I was so content of getting nothing because that GX card is so mint. The artwork is absolutely out of this world. We go and pull a full-up Bridget trainer card out of, like, a breakthrough boost pack. The one I was, like, bashing on so hard. Holy flipping moly mother duck. That is insane with the texture on there and everything. I think we've already pulled a Bridget trainer card because I reckon I've got a couple of these in my set. But what are the... <laughs> I don't <laughs> No full art card has ever caught me that off guard. Like, first boost pack, a set that I don't really, like, have any love for. And then we go and pull, like, the craziest, like, awesome card from the whole set. Just first up. That is ridiculous. Alright. Arceus is definitely up there. I feel like this new set is, like, blessed or something. Put that one to the side. Pokemon Sun and Moon. Let's, uh, let's, let's get this one open. Now, is this one four? No, no, no. It's the Evolutions four from the back, isn't it? Three from the back? Yep, looks like it. All right. <clears throat> Great ball. Come on, Raticate. Poplio, not too bad. Growlithe. Grubbin. Azubat. Torkoal, looking like an absolute boss. Reverse Poliwag. And then what do you reckon? Can we do another one? A McDouble Hollow? <laughs> oh, gosh, no. It's all right. It's a regular Ray Incineroar. He's an epic looking Pokemon, though. He looks like he needs to be on the front of like a Fruit Loops box. It is 11 and look at that. None other than an unlisted leaf energy. Bro, we can't complain at all. That's pretty good. That might even be a McDouble. I don't know. Unlisted leaf energy is pretty baller. 
Last Pokemon Sun and Moon pack. We're halfway through right now. I'm 98% sure that we're going to get absolutely nothing. Because the way these Pokemon, like, tins sort of work, they usually give you one boost back. It's out of this world. And then they'll just give you poo. They'll load it up with a fresh pile of poop, put in the boost back, and that's all you get. But, hopes are high, guys. Sarkenji, a uh, magic school bus. Sentinel, come on, we got a Meowth, a Growlithe, Rog and Roller, Cosmog, Reverse Skarmory, and then the final card is none other than a Hollow Flipping Crobat. Yo, that is sick. Look at the artwork. Oh, I don't know what that is, but that is, that's bonkers. Really simplistic, but like, the Hollow works so well in this card. Man, Pokemon Sun and Moon, they did it right. They did it, like, super duper well. And, like, also the fact this tin is giving us just the, the most majestic pulls of all time. Nothing that we sort of set out to go with, like, we really want that card, I really want, like, this sort of pull from this boost pack. But it's picking all the, like, really sick cards out of the sets, and it's like, you know what, Endo? Have this one, have this one. But, guys, there are so many cards in Evolutions that I would love to have, I don't think I've got yet, that we still need to pull on the channel. Stuff like Basic Charizard though, Golden Dragonite, we've actually pulled before, and I would love to double up on. So I'm thinking for the last one, we could literally get anything and it could make my day. Chances of that happening though, I think are super duper slim, oh my gosh. The Basic reprints, the coolest thing in the world. But yeah, I think it's super duper slim because we have pulled a Hollow and a Full Art, which usually means we get nothing at all. So we're gonna Magnemite, a Reverse Brox Grit, that's pretty cool, and then, none other- OH! Oh, come on! A Mega Pidgeot EX. Yeah, I think we pulled at least 18 of these. It's been absolutely hashtag great. But, like, what you got to appreciate right now is we've just pulled a Mega Pidgeot EX, a Full Art Trainer card, and a Holo, and a Promo GX, all inside of one tin that cost $25. Bruh. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what to say, guys. We've won. We've won lot. There's no point in opening any more boost backs because there is, like... That luck is unheard of for one, like, just one individual tin. Every booster pack but one had a hollow or better in it. And it doesn't even matter because we got a free GX, like, promo card with it anyway. Let's have a look at this recap though right now. We've got that hollow crowbat. The full art flipping Bridget training card, which just looks absolutely bonkers. The texture on it is nuts. So Galio promo GX card, which comes with every single tin with 230 damage. And then that mid oh, midget, <laughs> Mega Pidgeot EX. I'm literally flustered. I'm dead. I'm dying inside. What is this luck right now? Whatever you do, if you're going to do one thing in life, I'm just going to recommend you click the annotation right below the face cam, head straight to what is the Lunala GX tin opening because I'm so curious. Are these going to have any better pulls? I've got my fingers crossed, and I also still want to see like what the promo card looks like, because this one was absolutely bonkers. So yeah, smash the annotation, head straight to the next bar. I'll see you there, guys. But until next time, have an absolutely fantastic week. But most of all, go buy the Fling Soul Galio tin, because it's bananas. But most of all, get to keep on gaming. Alright, guys, till the next video. I'll see you then. Gosh, that was close. Alright. Next one. <sighs> Leave a comment in the comment section below. Do you think it's going to be possible? Do you think I can do it? Next one. Three. Two, one. Oh! Oh! Unlisted leaf energy.